<laughs> so yeah, he did that one. David Hoffman here from davidsbeenhere.com. Right now I'm on Avery Island in southern Louisiana, and if you didn't know, this part of the world, they speak Cajun. Cajun were the people that were French from Nova Scotia that came here and settled in the 1800s, right? That's right. And this is Dave, he's a local, and he speaks Cajun. You're gonna give us a little lesson today. Pleasure to meet you, sir. <laughs> Pleasure to meet you, too. We've been together for two days, like my new dad here. I'm a typical Cajun. Uh, okay. I grew up on Avery Island. Awesome. Uh, speaking French, naturally I'm French, speaking to my family's French. Here on Avery Island, they do have quite a bit of people that speak Cajun French. Okay. Cajun is it's like an English, but like things that we don't it could say. Be, it could be broken English. Uh, a lot of uh, words are in English and French, so we speak half English and half French. Okay, so what are some, you know, Man, usual like, things you guys say? Talk about, I was telling some of the girls, if I would tell you uh, that's a beautiful tree and you're a cage, you would you would probably answer me, talk about. It. Has nothing to do with talking about it. Okay. About our thing. But it's a Cajun uh, expression. Okay. And laissez les bons temps rouler is another one. Let the good time roll. L how do you say it? Laissez les bons temps rouler. Laissez les bons temps rouler. Laissez les bons temps rouler. That means uh, let the good time roll. In this area. We have uh, parades in, in different little towns every weekend. So if you want to go to, to a fair or something, we do have it. Okay. A Cajun, myself, as being a Cajun, I have a hard time pronouncing this, that, those, and them. So how would you say that? Well, that's exactly how I would say it. This, that, those, and them. This, that, those, and them. <laughs> yeah, so, you, you say it a little fast. I, I don't understand yeah, it. Yeah, I cannot, uh, Bring those words like this, you know what I'm like? Yeah. Like an Englishman would. Yeah, we have a lot of uh, dishes like boudin. That's boudin. a boudin, that's a French sausage with pork and then with rice. That's so a boudin. I've been eating boudin for like three days. Yeah. Well, they have a French card game, which is called bourrée. 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 Ouais, à la musique, I'm gonna say it in French. Okay. À la musique. Quand ils ont pu jouer de la musique, on voit un fait de deux. That's an outdoor dance. Outdoor dance, okay. Yeah, un fait de deux, we call it. It could last all night. <laughs> <laughs> a fait de deux. Fait de deux means sleep. But is this Cajun or is French now? That could be French. It could be fait French, okay. Yes, yeah, sometimes. Yeah? Yeah. 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 Uh, quand tu jettes au magasin, when you're buying something, a little uh, at the store and they give you a little more, that's a lanyap. Lanyap. That's what that means. Lanyap means a little more. They give you a little more for your money. Okay. Lanyap. Could be anything. Uh, anybody would be friendly with you, so lanyap. You know, a little more than what's expected. And what is Cajun? I mean, it's in a sense, it is like the French that they spoke in Nova Scotia mixed with, with English. With English, yes. Okay. We have an area that's about 50 mile radius of Lafayette, Louisiana, which has a, quite a bit of French speaking people okay. in this area. Well, quite a bit of people from McElhinney Company here on Avery Island, if they can't speak French, they understand it. Let's say we're eating and the food would be good, you could say, ça c'est bon. That means it's really good. Ça c'est bon. C'est bon. C'est bon. C'est bon. C'est bon. bon, okay. That's a French French word though. It's not a... It's not really it's Cajun. Not a Cajun slang. We seem to think, think of people that uh, come from a French family. The Cajun? The Cajun well, could be a Cajun, not necessarily. They don't come from France or maybe Canada. Canada. That, that's it. Yeah. And then parts of Africa. But Cajun is the, some of the people that migrated from Nova Scotia, speaks French, and located in this area. And when did they come here, do you know? Well, that was in the 1800s. 1800s? Yeah, from my time. Yeah, they were telling me that some most people that grew up in the 70s and 50s, yeah, 50s. everybody before is just French. That's correct. It seems like people do not have interest in what's going on okay. and try to learn French. Well, a lot of people, I mean, they have the boucheries in, in New Iberia. That is where they slaughter hogs or calves. It's a butchery. And, make, yeah. and butcher and make a boudin 
they make the boudin what I was telling you about, or uh, cut meats, and okay. you can purchase that from uh, but butchery uh, an area. And let me ask, so Cajun, is that only in this part of Louisiana, or is it the whole state? Oh, uh, the, the, the majority of it is in the state. Okay. But I'm not saying they don't have any. No, but I mean in like Alexandria yeah, and that area. No, it would mostly no. be south. South. South of Lafayette. South of Lafayette. 50 mile radius. Okay. Where these people, we settle, my family, settle in this area. So now you know what Cajun is. When you're in southern Louisiana, you're going to hear a lot of Cajun. And basically, it's a dialect between French mm -hmm. and, and English. Cajun. And I mean, I understand, but I don't understand yeah. certain things. That's all I understand. Yeah, for <laughs> sure. And if you didn't know, this is the home of Tabasco. So come to Avery Island, try Tabasco. If you've never tried before, which is crazy because most people in the world have tried Tabasco. So, like a Cajun, you see, ooh, good, man. <laughs>